Show with Atunike. Today, we're going to be discussing understanding your child's motive and action. Why do I say so? Let's find out. Hi, welcome back. So, why do you need to understand children's motives and actions? Motives are the reason why we do things, the reason why we do the things that we do. Then, motive and intention are interwoven, but they are two different things. Intention are what you want to do, why the motive are why you want to do it. So, children's motives and intentions are very important before taking any drastic actions, right? Sometimes our motives are positive, but then our actions may be negative. Say, for instance, I want to drink water, I'm holding a bottle of water. And the child is beside me and the child just feels that okay i might need a glass cup without telling the child the child is going to bring the glass cup for me but in the process of bringing it the cup fell down and broke as a parent it is my duty to understand the intention the motive of that child before taking any action but most parents don't understand they'll just be like oh who sent you message that's not what you saying and stuff like that which is not supposed to be so so that is the reason why their actions might be negative sometimes and their motives are positive. So we need to take our time to understand kids. As we are doing that, if you scold them like that, you might just instill fear in them. They might even be skeptical about helping people or be scared to help people next time because they don't know what that person might do. So when they are trying to do something, understand why. Even though you don't need that glass cup, appreciate it. Oh, thank you. Do you understand? Let them feel that you need them, you want them. Understand their actions. This is very, very important. Now, another thing to give children good intention is telling them to ask why before doing something. This is something I tell kids that I work with. I do tell them, Ask yourself why before doing anything. When you train them with this, they tend to ask themselves why before doing anything. I want to look for trouble. Why should I do it? Do you know? They tend to weigh it. Okay, will I get into trouble? Will you favor this person before doing it? And it has been proven that the children that I thought to ask why to do something before doing it, they end up behaving very, very well. Because once they do something wrong, I'll just tell them, but I told you to ask yourself why before doing it. And they know that they are supposed to apologize. So this is very, very important in raising children. Guys, guess what? Okay, so I plan to always drop a question at the end of my videos so that you can answer them in the comment section. So for today, our question will be, if you were to advise your younger self what advice would you give so the take of this video is don't jump into conclusion when your child does something try to understand the reason why they do the things that they do thanks for watching this video don't forget to like comment down below share this video subscribe catch you next week bye